Iowa has one of the lowest unemployment rates in the country, meaning that there are a lot of open jobs. But for the homeless people in Sioux City, applying for those jobs may be a challenge. If I can get my ID, I'd be good. <laughs> William Thunderhawk says it's difficult to apply for a job without a residential address, an identification card, or social security card. It delays me because I need I need the money to get those things I need in the first place, and me getting that money later on does me no good because I don't have it. Without those documents, he says the hiring process is a revolving cycle that leaves homeless people without the resources they need to make money for themselves. You need those to cash your checks. If you don't have that, then there's really no point in working if you can't get the money from it later. They just don't have the opportunity, the chance, or the information to like gain the, these things, these steps up that they need. The Salvation Army in Sioux City hoping to solve that problem through their new program called Pathway to Hope, designed to help homeless people retrieve those lost documents. So we, what we want to do is work with people on a long-term basis, whether it's six months to a year, and help them uh, move from their current situation, whether that means uh, finding employment, finding housing, uh, help with uh, getting documents that they may need. More than just providing a meal and one place to stay, he says Pathway to Hope can bring a true change in someone's life. In uh, Sioux City, there's a, a lot of need for uh, services uh, that go beyond traditional social services. And uh, we want to, again, just to help people to uh, move to a, a better point, a better place in uh, their lives. The Pathway to Hope program will begin November 11th, along with the Salvation Army's new warming center. In the newsroom, Tasia Nevels, KCAU 9 News.